My goodness, man. Yeah. My fucking goodness. Um. Still is on the clock, man. Like, I don't know what we're doing. Um, we traded Martavis Bryant to the Raiders for their third round pick. The, the 79th overall pick, so we no longer have Martavis Bryant. Like I said, you know, Bryant, I thank you for what you did with Steelers Nation. I appreciate how you fought your demons, how you got over your addiction of, like, marijuana and everything like that. Right. I appreciate how you fought so hard to get back on the football field to uh, reclaim, regain your NFL career. And I appreciate that, and I thank you for everything you did for, for the Steelers and Steelers Nation. Yeah. Um, and now that you're with the Raiders, you know, I am... I wish you the best in your future endeavors. Yeah, so do I. Um, I, 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 I would still uh, continue to root for Montero's body. No matter um, where it goes. But we do like the trade for three reasons. One, no more drama. Two, more than likely we would have gotten rid of him anyway. So Why not get something out of him? In which we did. So I like that we got something good and something high out of him. And three, we can easily replace him because now with us trading Montero's Bryant, we... I definitely see us going receiver early. Whether that be now, the pick is in. Yeah, the Steelers um, pick is in, guys. I, I can see us going receiver now. I can see us going receiver tomorrow, second or third round. Uh, I think we're going receiver tomorrow. But, you Unless know. Maybe if we go right here. Does Cortland Sun, Christian Kirk, we want to make a reach for DJ Chark? Um, I don't know, man, but Darius Geis is still on the board. Mason Rudolph, who we put in many mocks, is still on the board. I think we should take him. Uh, you know, we got a plan for our future, and he is there, so I think we should take him. Um, or we could go safety with Justin Reed. Maybe we go corner. Maybe we go tight end. I don't know what the hell we're doing. I don't know either, man. It's it's like, oh, man. It's difficult. We do not know who we're going to get. We don't. Um, we are entirely confused, and we will forever be confused until Goodell, and he is here. All right, still selection. All right, here it is. Here we go, guys. Next Pittsburgh Steeler. I love this. this. Oh, oh wow. wow, look at him. Ryan Shazier, man. This is that, that just puts a smile on my face, man. Shay leave, man. He's obviously still struggling, but still to see that he's getting better, man. Look at him. All smiles, good spirits. This, this is great to see, man. And speaking of Sejir, you know, linebackers like Van Der Resch and John Evans are gone, so. Alright, who we got? Ooh! Safety from Virginia Tech! Terrell Edmonds in the first round? Oh, wow! Okay! I like the pick. Uh, um, I'm I'm not hating it. I just I just feel like it was a bit of a reach. I think we could have saved him for day two, for like second or, or one of our third it's, rounds. Yeah, it's, especially since with since we have three picks tomorrow, I think we definitely could have saved him for round two. Now don't round three. now don't get us wrong. Like we're not hating the pick. We're just a little shy because he was. You know, said to be a day two guy. I think he was going to be picked at us for the first round, but. Yeah. I mean, there's no doubt Terrell Emmons, he's a phenomenal athlete. He can play both linebacker and safety. He's just more of a safety, but he's a phenomenal athlete. He's very versatile. You know, could very well be a big future safety for us, you know. And that's what I like about him. He's versatile. He can play safety, he can play inside linebacker. He's a very smart, very physical, very fast, very tall, very strong. Uh, uh, safety inside linebacker, you know, he's really everything we need at the safety and inside linebacker position. If we want to, we can put him inside linebacker or we can put him at safety. Um, but, but Terrell Lemons, he got good size at six feet. He's got good speed. He ran, he ran a 4.47. Nice strength. Very good tackling ability. You know, uh, he, he could work on his tackling a little bit, though. Right, but, but he can, you know, start 
start on special teams against feet wet, you know, with the team. You know, again, we're not hating it. We like Troy Lyman. We like, you know, his talent. Right, and Mike Tomlin has came out and expressed that he loves Terrell Edmond. And I, I, I'm a fan of Terrell Edmond, man. Yeah, I love his talent. Him as well. I just think that we could have saved him for day two. I think he would last to day two, seriously. Yeah, I do I do as well, but hey, we got Terrell Edmonds. I'm not hating the pick at all. Neither I, am I. I, I love the we pick. just feel like, you and, know, he was a do, day two guy. Right, and I appreciate the fact that we are thinking about our future solution at safety or inside linebacker, wherever you want to put Edmonds. I appreciate the fact. I really like the pick. I like that we are thinking about our future defensively. Um, I just think we could have saved him until day two. I mean, he may, may, may not have lasted, but I think we could have saved him. I mean, I could be wrong, um, but, I mean, I like the pick. I did not really expect it. It's a shocking pick, in my opinion. Yeah, it is, but... Um, I do kind of wish we would have taken Rudolph, though, since he was there. But there is still a possibility. Now, it's very unlikely, but the Steelers, with three uh, day two picks, we could trade up and still get him. I mean, I don't know if that's just us being extremely hung on Rudolph or us just thinking about a future of both. I think it's both. Uh, but you can't really blame us at all for thinking any of that. No, you can't. But yeah. Edmonds, 28th overall, I like the pick. I love his versatility. I love his talent. I love his height. I love everything he possesses. And I absolutely love the pres uh, the presentation, you know, with Shazier making. Right, and it was phenomenal. Yeah, it was, um, it was amazing. See him walk and everything, you know, that was a great sight just to see. just see him be there. It was amazing. Right. Um, And I love that, and I appreciate and love the fact that we are thinking about our future solution, that safety or inside linebacker, wherever we want to put Edmonds. Don't matter. Um. I like the pick. I just think we could have saved it for day two. That, that, that's As do me. I, but hey, he's a big and explos explosive athlete. He's a box safety. He can be a dime linebacker, and he can match those tight ends. Which, he can cover those tight ends. Right, which we obviously need help with. So I like the pick. I really do. I love his talent. You know, like we said, we love his versatility. We love everything he possesses, and he's a guy Mike Tomlin was extremely high on, as were we, and he's very great in coverage. Uh, he's a nice ball-hawking safety. Could work on attack ability, but the thing I like about this is that he's obviously not going to start day one, which means he'll develop under Morgan Burnett or or Vince Williams or whoever or wherever we want to put him. He's not going to be day one starter, which means that when he eventually develops in that starting role, he won't be pressured, he'll be ready, you know, all that shit. Absolutely. So I, I like the fact of that. Um, I just think we could have saved him for day two, but I like the pick. Uh, Terrell Edmonds, welcome to the black and gold. Welcome to Pittsburgh. Glad to have you. Very big on you. And, um... I'm really excited to see what you can do with this team, man. Yep, so, absolutely. Welcome to Pittsburgh. So, yeah. Great pick. I like it. Yeah, good pick. Um, like I said, I just think we should have saved it for round two. I mean, he might have not lasted round two. I don't know. That's just me. I don't um, know. His his style was kind of gaining, so I can see why. But yeah, right. I still think it was a day two guy. Right, but I, I I'm not. But technically, you know where we put our position in, uh, in the draft. Technically, it is kind of a early first, really, since it's so late in the first round. Right. And so it, I can understand why. And we are kind of pressured to reach a little bit, and that's kind of what the Steelers tend to do. Reach. Yeah, like they, do, they always like to reach. Like we did with Dupree and Audie Burns, and many people say T.J. Watt was a reach. We yeah. probably did the same with uh, Terrell Edmonds. Um, so. But I think Terrell Edmonds with us has the talent and the ability to be a great safety for us. I do. Great defensive player for us. Uh, wherever we want to put him. So. A guy that can make turnovers, a guy that can... Help this team, help the team, help this defense a lot. Right, and like I said, the, the great thing about it is that he won't start day one, so he can develop, which will be beneficial for him. Absolutely. So I really like the pick. Um, so we'll see what he can do. Glad that he's in the black and gold. Glad to see or excited to see what he can do. So uh, nice pick. So absolutely. Do the outro. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. I forgot we were recording because we're live streaming. My bad. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you later. Peace. Peace.